All right, we're going. All right, this is 2015 playbook number one. Um, I mentioned it last night. I um, I had five to ten teams where somebody really wanted a team and got shut out. So I might do a second break. I'm probably going to do a second break on Sunday, and I'm probably going to let those people have first dibs at the team and then go and sell the teams from there just to help them out. I think most of them were people teams they actually collected to. So I'll put that on Facebook probably tomorrow at some point and work on filling it up for Sunday. Uh, I wanted to get through the first case first before I worked on it. But we are set, ready to go. First case. We have JD with the Cardinals. JD with the Falcons. RFP Jr. with the Baltimore Ravens. Josh ha uh, has the Buffalo Bills. RFP Jr. has the Panthers. Dennis has the Chicago Bears. Scott Stacy has the Cincinnati Bengals. Don has the Cleveland Browns. Jerry has the Dallas Cowboys. Don has the Denver Broncos. Kevin has the Detroit Lions. Steve L. has the Green Bay Packers. Vincent has the Houston Texans. Scott C. has the, I think Scott Courtney has the Indianapolis Colts. Igoff has the Jaguars. Allen has the Chiefs. Uh, Michael Nelson has the Miami Dolphins. Dennis has the Minnesota Vikings. RFP Jr. has the Patriots. Dennis has the Saints. Mark O. has the New York Giants. Uh, Cy has the Jets. Scott Stacy has the Oakland Raiders. Allen has the Philadelphia Eagles. Greg Thorpe has the Pittsburgh Steelers. Um, Allen has the San Diego Chargers. Chauncey has the San Francisco 49ers. Uh, Brian Mitchell has the Seattle Seahawks. Dennis has the Rams. Allen has the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Ricky has the Titans. And iGolf has the Redskins. So I think we're ready to go. This product has a lot of duels and triples, but I think they're I think they're mostly the same teams. But I could be wrong. But just in case they have duels and triples that are different teams, there's no majority rules. So if you have one of the three players on a triple and they're different teams, you would have a third of a chance in the random no matter what. So you don't get shut out. Uh, other than that, we got a case right here. Jason picked it out. Must mean it's good luck. I have not seen a single pack opened of 2015. I don't think Jason has either, so I'm not sure what to think. Yeah. I saw one card really nice posted on Box Busters that was hit in a different room, Yank's room. He had a one of one that was nice, six player auto. Oh, wow. So they do have they do have those six player autos that are really tough. So if we get that for every team you have on it, you have one sixth of a chance. And if it's really big, and you guys want me to try to sell it for you or something on eBay right away, we can do that too, or I can random it. Good luck, thank you, Scott. There is another football next week, uh, Finest Football. They're finally coming out. I got charged for it, so. It's only been delayed numerous times, yeah. Dead. I guess I don't need to worry about an order, because we're opening all these. It's a nice card, isn't it? We got Brady some autographs of Brady in here. Not many, but he's on a little bit. I know that this year there are three packs instead or three cards per pack instead of two. They did base cards in this product. Um, they're like three um, three players on it base cards, I think for the same team. All right. Yep. Yeah, says right on the front. Every box includes one base playbook booklet, one autograph or memorabilia booklet, and one additional autograph or memorabilia card. So we still have 45 hits plus the bonus box that we're throwing in. We'll do that last.
Thanks, Greg and Chauncey, for being around to get those picks done quick so we didn't have a delay there. Got a card in a sleeve. See that? Hmm. Greg or uh, Greg deserves a big card having a second child this week. He should be have some good luck, good karma somewhere. Let me figure out how I want to do these. There's one card in a sleeve. So I'm curious. It's almost falling out. So I'm going to show that first. It says playbook 14 of 299. Jamal Charles and Justin Houston. Oh, okay, this is the base card, I guess. So that's the base card. 14 of 299, Charles and Houston for the Kansas City Chiefs. They put the base cards in the sleeves, I guess. All right, for the hits. Got an auto jersey for the Atlanta Falcons. 18 of 25, Matt Ryan. Wow, that's a great start. That's a great way to start, absolutely. 18 of 25. Kind of interesting to just put a sticker on the inside of a card. Yep. It doesn't look too bad, though, partly because Matt knows how to sign a sticker. Low numbered, 18 to 25. Take that. And the book card says rookie on the outside. Vertical book. Carlos Williams for the Buffalo Bills. Got a full side of jersey here. And a little bit of jersey over there too. Number 195 of 199. Yeah, I'll take some for for the uh, non-book cards. Box two. Show that base card around the front each time it start. Five three Mets. Five three Mets. Syndergaard settled down a little bit then, huh? Mm -hmm. Did he make it past the fifth? No. Got Stahlbach and Aikman, ninety three of ninety nine. Dual base for the Cowboys. And the hits. Seems like when you get a really good non-book card, the book's always a jersey. Another low-numbered one. 18 of 49 on this one. Percy Harvin for the Buffalo Bills. 18 of 49 of Percy Harvin. Second hit for the Bills already. It's Josh and the book card is the Pittsburgh Steelers Sammy Coates number 168 of 199 for Sammy Coates all right box three What inning is that game in? 
Why? In the five. Oh, really, Greg? I saw on Boxbusters there was a six-way auto one of one up there. Somebody hit earlier today. Some big cards. Matt Ryan was nice, but hoping we hit some bigger cards. Getting some of the same teams early on. Third card for the Bills. Jim Kelly and Thurman Thomas. Kind of weird. They put, I guess they put them in sleeves because they pop out if they didn't. Back to the Steelers. Autograph number 153 of 199, Bud Dupree. Did never hit anything of this guy. Now I'm hitting him like crazy. Yeah, my player breaks. I had the same person buy him over and over, and he kept whiffing. Ooh, we got something multiple here. This might be good. Eight what? God, I thought I had it the right way. Eight patches here. Oh, man. Wow, look at that. I'm looking for a number to start with. Holy cow. I can't find it. Are they on the other side? On the other side. Five of 49 is the number. Active eight. Active eight. All right, everybody. Here's uh, who's on it. There'll be eight owners. We got Jameis Winston, Marcus Mariota. Leonard Williams, Amari Cooper, Kevin White, Todd Gurley, Melvin Gordon, and Devontae Parker. And the Winston and Mariota patches are really nice. That's a neat card. What's up, Rob? So, let me just go through the eight spots real quick. We got Allen with one spot. Ricky with a spot, Scott with a spot, Scott Stacy, Cy with a spot, Dennis with a spot, Dennis with a second spot, Michael Nelson with a spot, and Alan with the second spot. So I'll probably random this unless you guys want me to. I mean, what, what do you think is the approximate book va or value on that? You know, Jason. Mm -hmm. Okay, Probably a random. $100, yeah. I don't know if it would make sense splitting it up eight ways with value wise if it's not. But it's up to you guys. If one person really wants that card and wants to try to buy the spots from other people, that's always an option too. Uh, Sigari did that one time and it worked out pretty well. He wanted the card and he just bought spots. He offered a certain amount per spot, and everybody took it because it was a fair offer. About the smoothest way I ever had a big card. I can't remember what it was. Yeah. There was several owners. Nice card there, though. Not a bad start. Base card is for Houston Oilers, which is Tennessee Titans, Earl Campbell, and Warren Moon. This one's out of 199. 76 of 199. Hot Routes, Jerry Rice for the San Francisco 49ers. <laughs> You're on the board, Chauncey. Got yourself a nice jersey card of Jerry Rice. It's actually a nice looking card. 76 of 199. Oh, okay. Yep. 
I bet we have an autograph book card here. God, the A's on the break before that, Chauncey, were just fantastic. That's too bad. Oh, look at that patch. Nice. Philadelphia Eagles, Nelson Aguilar. That's that awesome. is a patch. Wow. That's beautiful. That is a patch. Actually, the other side's nice, too. I got absolutely. That's gonna, that's gonna be pretty low number. I got no idea it was Philly. Alan, you got Philly. It was your second choice too, wasn't it, Alan? Nine of ten. Alan took Philly because he missed out on the team he wanted. That's a nice card, Alan. That's nine of ten, and that's unique. I mean, those patches are great. That is a unique card. Boy, the last two books have been nice. Yeah. Yep, that's a good idea. Yeah, they're perfect for the sleeve they're in. They just need a top loader security. You guys, I don't have any like mags or anything for books right now. I was gonna order some and I missed out, but I got I'm gonna have some next week. So I keep that in mind. I'll post the price. If you get a book card that you really want to display, um, I'll have those available. They're not cheap. It's one thing I have reason why I haven't bought a lot of them in the past is they're kind of expensive. But I think I got a decent deal on a case. LaShawn McCoy, Sammy Watkins. We've had a lot of Bills cards already. Next card's got multiple players on it, too. Looks like we got three quarterbacks, number 12 of 50. Jameis Winston, Marcus Mariota, and Garrett Grayson. That's pretty neat. We will random this one to the spots, Tampa. Allen will have a spot. Ricky. Dennis will have a spot and Ricky will have a spot. I like having the no majority rule. I don't have to worry about if somebody clips the other person. I really think it's fair to everybody to have a spot in the random no matter how many teams they bought. All right, book card. We got some nice cards already. This one's autographed too. iGolf is on the board with Richard Green. Not as crazy a patch as iGolf, but it's still a solid book auto. Signed on the rookie symbol. On card number 101 of 199. Hey, what's that mantle on your, um, that you have, iGolf? I couldn't tell what grade it was. I love that on the front of your uh, display on your Facebook page, though. PSA four. Wow. What's that? What'd you pay for that? It looks really nice. That's really the best. Those middle grades, like four, five, and six, are easily the best deal on those things because they still look nice yet they don't break your bank. Oh, sweet. <clears throat> Green Bay is on the board for Steve. Just a base card, though, for Steve so far. I usually hit Green Bay okay in a break, though, so I doubt this will be the end of it. Rodgers and Nelson. Base card, 127 of 199. We got a bonus card in this one. Bonus card time. Three cards in here. Make one of them a one of one type bonus. 
77 of 199 autograph Charles Sims auto jersey for Tampa. Tampa and Tennessee have had a lot of, I guess they're in multiple player cards, but Charles Sims. We will likely, uh, likely have a decent amount of randoms after this. What's its book value right now? John, I haven't filed those mantles, but it's got to be more than that, isn't it? Is eBay value? <laughs> one forty of one ninety nine draft edition Johnny Manziel. It's kind of an unusual card. That's the bonus card. It's just a jersey. But it's kind of a neat card in his Texas A uh, and M uniform. That card never goes down in value, John. It's a good one to keep. Actually, a lot of vintage cards never go down in value. Vintage cards over the last thirty years have been. Better investment than most things. All right, book card. Don't see an auto on this one. Tyler Lockett, though. Everything I see of Tyler Lockett's going really well. For the Seattle Seahawks. Book card of Lockett. Number 173 of 199 for Brian. Next one. Can I get these ready or are you going to reveal them? I wouldn't do anything with them other than maybe sort them between auto and non auto. That's a thick pack. Have all the packs been that thick? No, that's something different. That's a giant. You might have multiple books in that. It's a good time for the Lions to show up right now, Kevin. What is in this thing? All right. Two books and a card. Playbook this year seems to be doing some bonus cards. I like that. We got a bonus book on this one. The base card is for the Saints. Drew Brees and Mark Ingram. Number to 199. <laughs> this looks like another one like the Johnny Manziel. 169 of 199. Odell Beckham Jr. Draft edition, LSU uniform on the left, and then Giants on the right. Kind of unusual cards. They're probably doing this because they got the college license now. They're trying to do more stuff with uh, bringing their college into it. All right, book number one. Ooh, this could be a good one. Oh, I saw the awesome patches. Buck Allen for the Baltimore Ravens. Nice patches again on this one. This might be fairly low numbered. 43 of 99. So they've kind of changed their book cards this year, huh? They're all the vertical books now. Isn't that different than last year? I do too. I like the vertical books a lot better. They look cooler in those book slabs too. Horizontal, uh, horizontal books. I don't know. There's some people like them. They're just not for me. 
Buck Allen. Second one. This one is Jarvis Landry. Well, that's different. It's very different. It's an unusual book. You'd have to display it like this, though. I don't think there's a case. It would look good like that, though. In a slam. Or in a holder like that. Jarvis Landry for the Miami Dolphins. That's Michaels. Number 19 of 99. So just two books in that one. Nice card for the Ravens for sure there. Jersey for the Dolphins and Giants. This is, uh, I'm on eight. I guess it's your turn. I'll open this one. You, you want to open, don't you? You just want to keep going, so I'm going to recap. Or... Sure. I'll keep going if you want. I want to hit a one of one is what I really want to hit. The great thing about one of ones, you can put almost anybody on it, and it goes good. Russell Wilson and Marshawn Lynch, the base card for Seattle. Back to a box with just two two cards I didn't Rob the good news for it is I'm not as worried because it's gonna rain here all day tomorrow so I struck out on the white pants but I got everything else oh, I've struck out on the mustache so far too I cannot find a mustache a fake mustache for my Hayden Fry costume anybody got any hints of where I could go get one because we are striking out. It's a three-player one. All Panthers. Benjamin, Funches, and Newton. <laughs> what are you doing over on Breakers for, Rob? Did they kick you out of Box Busters? Because your comments are more Box Buster worthy. Nice card for the Panthers. Newton, Funches, and Benjamin. We try to keep the breakers a little more clean. We know you, your comments are usually running dirty. Ooh! Is this a one of one? I opened it up. It looked like some sort of plate. I'm looking for a number real quick. Eh, screw it. I'm just going to show it. Looks like a plate. Andre Williams, autographed jersey. The top part is a plate, so I'm hoping it says one of one on the other side after I show the autograph. Not getting good focus. It is. One of one. Good break for the Giants. It's a printing plate auto of Andre Williams. I've hit a ton of Andre Williams tough cards in the last year and a half. Number nine. I have not watched a giant game this year. Is he still carrying the ball for him? Andre? Yeah. No, they got kind of a game going. Do they? I haven't heard anything about him this year, so I figured he's not doing much. Yeah, Would have loved to see Odell there, but we got two books on this one too. No bonus, no other card though. So just two books. First card is Elway and Manning. Base card for the Denver Broncos. Look at this one. It's kind of a neat base with those two together. All right, the first book, no autograph, red jersey of Chris Conley. 
rookie wide receiver for the Kansas City Chiefs. From Georgia, I think he was. Might be a good receiver in the NFL. A nice number. 0 0 1 of 199. First one off the line for Conley. I bet this one has I bet this one has ink on it. It does have ink. Denver Broncos. Cody Latimer. Nice patches there for you. 14 of 15. Boy, there was some other Denver choices that are out of 15 that might have been a little more special, but nice card there, nice patches. Denver had a nice checklist when I was doing prices on that. Six left. Still time for a mirror, Kevin. <laughs> We're not done yet. Matt, J Matt Ryan and Julio Jones for the Falcons. Back to a standard pack. One book. Autograph number 104 of 199 of Landon Collins for the New York Giants. Giants having a good break. Been a lot of Giants so far. is probably going to be a non-auto. Oh, it wouldn't be a break without Jeremy Hill. <laughs> All right. So funny. Three colors there and one color up top of Jeremy. Bengals are on the board. Now, if Jeremy Hill could just put up some better stats for me in fantasy football, I'd be happy. Number 10 of 25 for Scott Stacy. Five left. Thick pack. Kind of nice the base card's always on top. You don't have to really use a blocker when you open. Thick pack, we got two books and an extra card. The base card is of the Atlanta Falcons. Matt Ryan and Julio Jones. I've said the Falcons a lot this break, haven't I? All right, first card. Mammoth jerseys for the Bears. Jeremy Langford, number 93 of 99. I think that might be the first Bears card. Oh, Kevin White's on that uh, multiple. Book card. This one is signed. Buck Allen. Dupes on him. Dupes on Buck Allen. Buck is number 22 of 25. Getting a lot of low numbered ones. For the Ravens.
Book number two. Darrell Green Beckham. Vertical book, one color. Number 113 of 199. Four left. Plus the Valor. Kind of a fun product to open. All right, we got multiple cards in this one too. All right, somehow the the base card got stuck to the pack. Let me try to remove this without ruining it. I think it's fine. Sleeves kind of ruined, but the card's fine. Vikings with the base card at a 199 with Bridgewater and Peterson. Two book cards. The non book card has a three players on it. We got TJ Yeldon, Melvin Gordon, and Todd Gurley. So that will be the random also. 177 of 199. Book cards. Ooh. That's a nice one. Brett Hunley. Look at that color there. Congrats, Steve. Hit yourself a nice Hunley card. Hit Packers well this year. Brett Hunley, number 19 of 49. You're welcome, Steve. Book number two. Mike Evans for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Mike Evans. Mike Evans is number 27 of 99. Three left. <clears throat> this one only has one book in it for sure. God, this pack was kind of ravished. I hope the cards are okay in this one. Fine. Got another three player card. First, we got Matt Ryan, Julio Jones, 95 of 99. Have I hit like four base cards of the Falcons? Seems like I've said Julio Jones and Matt Ryan numerous times. <laughs> it's... Uh, there's two other ones. Yeah, that's three. <laughs> we got three players on this one, and they are all Tennessee Titans, it appears. Marcus Mariota, Darrell Green, Beckham, and David Cobb. Number three of 199 for the Titans. Nice card there for Ricky. And the book card. Auto two piece of Darrell Green Beckham. That was all Titans in this box. For Ricky, number 32 of 199.
Two left. Get them both down to packs real quick. <laughs> All right, let's see this one. That one might have two books in it. I'm going to open this one first. You were hot earlier this year, Kevin. You're too down on yourself or on me. Remember when we had that little burst of Amir Abdullah's? You crushed it on Spectra. Spectra is, I think, your product. You've hit that twice in a row. You're going to have to become a Spectra only. The Stafford the year before was an extremely nice one of one. What's up, Shimmy? Look at that. The Lions are on the board. Boom, Lions. Base card, Calvin Johnson and Matthew Stafford. It is number four of 25. It's the lowest number one we got. Lowest one we got. Stafford and Johnson. He's holding out for his Mira Dula autograph. <laughs> Number 131 of 199, Draft Edition, Devontae Parker. Whew, excuse me. For the Miami Dolphins. Buck card. Yeah, Montana has some cards in this. He's in the Niners. The Niners got some really... Great hits, but they're real low numbered. The Jets are on the board. Devin Smith. Two colors on one side, one color on the other. Number 01 of 49. Does not want to focus. It's 01 of 49. Last shot before we go to Valor. Pick me out a winner there in Valor. Nah, you pick. You've been on a hot streak picking stuff lately. Right. Two books. Base card, Ben Roethlisberger and Le'Veon Bell, 148 of 299. Taj Boyd is gone. Don't put it past him to have a Taj Boyd in here somewhere. Trying to dodge Taj. Oh, that's a nice card. Stefan Diggs in the last box. Both sides have two colors, some stitching. Six of 25. It's a nice card there. And the last book card before we do the Balor box. No ink, Philip Dorsett. <laughs> <laughs> Jordan Lynch has made an appearance. <laughs> Philip Dorsett, 10 of 199. All right, let's see if I can hit somebody in Valor that did not hit well in the playbook as a bonus. Got four hits in here. 
I sold in Valor. I sold uh, ten boxes out of my last case to somebody. So I have no idea what was in the case. It was shipped out somewhere. It went to. I can't remember. So I'm hoping I kept the two best boxes. We'll do the randoms right after this. How long did uh, Syndergaard pitch, Jerry? Sigari's a Royals fan, but even he was at rooting for the Mets tonight. Want to keep the series going. Nobody wants to win in four games. He went six. He didn't look that good in the first couple innings, to be honest. He wasn't throwing the heat like he was uh, last game. Too much off speed, or he couldn't get the fastball going, or what? It didn't seem like he was at the start, though. He does average 99 when he's throwing fastballs, but in the second inning, every time I was watching a pitch, it was like 88 miles an hour, 89. Oh, cool. He might be a little nervous. I didn't see that. Is that nerves or was he trying to say something? You don't really want to rile up the other team right away. <laughs> All right. Valor bonus box. Should have four hits hiding in here. I think I saw one or two of them on the back. It's one of them right here, I believe. Autograph for the Panthers, Cameron Artist Payne, number 39 of 800. Panthers running back. I'll do the randoms first before the um, recap. So if you want to take off, you can after the randoms. Peyton Manning insert. Elshon Jeffrey insert card. Three are pretty good randoms. Oh. Jersey card, Stefan Diggs for the Minnesota Vikings, five of seventy-five. Set that there so I can get going. Russell Wilson, number two thirty-three of two ninety-nine. Odell Beckham Jr. insert. Auto Relic for the Green Bay Packers, Ty Montgomery, number 86 of 100. It's got a tiny bit, you guys can see it there, a tiny bit of chipping on the bottom, but Auto's nice. Nice card there for you, Steve. 86 of 100 for the pack. J. 
JJ Watt numbered to 199. About a one of one part parallel. Heart parallel. Yeah, the, the one of ones I think are called heart or something like that. Jerry Rice insert. Last hit of the break. It's a nice patch for the Ravens. Number 9 of 25, Bashar Perryman. And that is it for the break. Sorry for those teams that missed out. I know there was a few. I can think of two already. Three. Four. I see four teams that didn't hit much. Let me do the randoms. Have a good night, Jerry. Thanks, Scott. Boy, the Raiders completely whiffed, didn't they, too? Well, you, you're in the... Cooper was in the random, didn't he? I don't think so. No? I, mean, I don't remember. He would have been in the first eight picks, wouldn't he? Yeah, he's in it. Don't take off yet, Scott. You're in one of these randoms. Sorry, Kevin. All right, let me set these up. All right, random number one is 12 of 50. Three pat really nice patches here. We're going to go from top to bottom in the randomizer. So we're going to have Tampa, Tennessee, and the Saints. Oops. I'll put in the player names, actually. Winston, Mariota, and Grayson. Saints card we had too. Five times on this one. Five times. Again, on the card, we got Winston on the top, Mariota's in the middle on the card, and Grayson on the bottom. Five times, whoever's on top on the fifth click gets the card. Sorry for the other two. Everybody's been on top. Fifth and final time. Marcus Mariota is the winner of the first one. Five times. Five times. Congrats, Ricky. You win the first card. Second card. We got Todd Gurley in the front, or at the top, Melvin Gordon, and TJ Yeldon. Going 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and the tenth and final time. Melvin Gordon for the Chargers is the winner on this one. Card is numbered out of 199 with Gurley, Gordon, and Yeldon. Ten times six and a four is ten. So we got chargers on the middle. First one was 
Tampa, and then the eight-player book card, number five of 49. Right there again. So it goes across and then down. So I'm going to go put this in here the way we always do it. So Winston's going to be in the first spot. Then Marriott is in the second. And the next level on the left side is Cooper. And then Williams. Second row starts off with Kevin White. Then Gurley. Parker. And Melvin Gordon on the last spot. So got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight spots. Congrats to the winner. Let's see who it is. Four and a six is ten times. Ten times. No good. Okay. Good luck. Parker Cooper. Cooper. Parker and Cooper has been on the top every time. Eight. Nine. Tenth and final time right here. Only one that matters. Todd Gurley for the St. Louis Rams. One of Dennis's two spots, I believe. Sorry, everybody else. Especially Cooper and Parker. My, they dominated this till that one. Ten times. Four and a six is ten. All right, I'm going to do a quick recap. going to try another case I believe on Sunday if you want back in on another one let me get my chat back up when I'm doing this okay all right this was playbook this is what we got out of our first case here on Friday night we got a Jerry Rice jersey out of 199 Jeremy Langford Langford jersey out of 99, three Titan jersey, Marietta, Cobb, and Beckham out of 199. Uh, same thing for the Panthers, Benjamin, Newton, and Funches out of 199. We have jersey cards of Devontae Parker, Odell Beckham Jr., and Johnny Manziel. Those are all out of 199. These were just the jersey books. Okay. I'll give book cards here for the recap that were just jerseys, no autos. We had Philip Dorsett out of 199. Darrell Green, Green Beckham out of 199. Chris Conley out of 199. That's 001 of 199. Sammy Coates, 199. Tyler Lockett. 199 and Carlos Williams for the Bills 199 for the other design jerseys okay other jerseys these are a little lower numbered out of 99 Mike Williams Evan, Evan sorry uh, Jarvis Landry out of 99 and out of 25 Jeremy Hill Autos and auto Regular autographs. We had Landon Collins out of 199. Bud Dupree out of 199. Charles Sims with a jersey out of 199. Percy Harvin out of 49. Auto jersey. 
And the first card we got in the break for the Atlanta Falcons, Matt Ryan, 18 of 25. Book cards that are autographed. We got Darrell Green Beckham out of 199. Got Green for the Jags out of 199. Devin Smith. The Jets, uh, 0 1 of 49. Brett Hundley for the Packers. Really nice card there, 19 of 49. We got a pair of Buck Allens. That's the first one. That one's out of 49. And then we got another low numbered Buck Allen. That one's 22 of 25. Stephon Diggs <clears throat> for the <coughs> Minnesota Vikings. Six of 25. And Nelson Aguilar, this was like early on for the Eagles. It's one of the nicest patches you'll see. Nice card there. That's nine of 10. that book. Okay, a couple others. Cody Latimer. It's a low numbered one too there for the Broncos. That one's 14 to 15. And Andre Williams. This one was a one of one. Printing plate book. For the Giants. Okay. Yeah, I'll show the Valor ones too. The bonus Valors. We threw in a box of Valor for it. Artist Payne, numbered 800 autograph. Stephen D Stephon Diggs jersey. Brashard Perryman for the Ravens out of 25. Ravens had a good break. And Ty Montgomery for the Packers out of 100 auto relic. And that, combined with the three cards we random that were shown right before that, is the whole break. Thanks. Nah, we showed them. We showed them right at the random. They saw them enough. But that eight-player one was really nice. Congrats again for Dennis for that card. We will uh, luckily do another one Sunday night.